Hey guys, welcome to Thursday, another edition of All Things Real Estate. This Thursday, I'm bringing you something a little bit different. It is not just me in the video this time. It is one of my favorite title company people. She is from Alamo Title, and her name is Ashley Polito. And uh, we just decided to get together and do a little Q&A session. And what I'm including for you today is two questions that she asked me about sellers, different things that I thought that sellers would, um, would find important. So stay tuned and see what we talked about. So everyone keeps talking that this is a seller's market. Is it really a seller's market? What does this mean? Yeah, so it is still a seller's market. That is true. Um, you put your house on the market and it has a million offers in two or three days. It still happens, yes. But what I am here to tell you is it is not going to last for much longer. It can't last for much longer. This craziness in the market um, has got to, it's got to slow down at some point. And I also see that what sellers are doing right now is they're doing things that they shouldn't be. They're overpricing their houses by thirty, forty thousand dollars $40,000. They're not paying attention to the marketing that their agents are doing. They're not presenting their homes in the best way that they can. And so um, the short answer is yes, it still is a seller's market, but the long answer is it won't last for very long and sellers are getting overconfident and it's not a good idea. Ready to sell my house? Mm -hmm. Can I just use my iPhone for pictures? Oh, no, 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 no. You don't use your iPhone and your agent doesn't use their iPhone either, people. Don't let that happen. Um, it is so important to present your house in the best way possible through professional photos, through some uh, professional staging, through video. All of those things are super, super important. Not only to present your house um, in the best way possible just from a uh, professional agent standpoint, but it makes sellers more money. Literally, I have seen where sellers are leaving ten or twenty thousand dollars on the table because their marketing is crappy and their house doesn't sell quickly, and it does. It's not um, in competition for bidders. So definitely take professional. That's all I got for you. Thanks so much for tuning in. If you like what you're seeing, please subscribe. I would super super appreciate it. And please tune in next week for another edition of All Things Real Estate every Thursday. Thanks, guys. Bye. Real estate as well.